Hello everyone. Welcome back to Akash Baju's College Review Series. The NIT we are going to discuss today has its home in the beautiful city of Calicut. The city which is well known for its serene beaches, waterfalls, prehistoric sites and wildlife centuries. Yes, National Institute of Technology, Calicut. Aka NIT C. NIT Calicut is one of the institutions of national importance and was originally established in the year 1961 as a regional engineering college. Further, the college was transformed into National Institute of Technology in the year 2002. NIT Calicut was ranked 23rd in the engineering, second in architecture stream and 54th in the overall NIRF 2023. Let's have a look at its wonderful campus. Set in picturesque landscape at the foothill of the Western Ghats, NIT Calicut is located about 22 kilometers northeast of Calicut city in the state of Kerala. The campus is spread over 285 acres. The NITC is entirely residential institution with 13 hostels for boys and girls. There are about 4500 students already staying in the hostel. Moreover, the institute has a well equipped library computer center lecture hall complexes various laboratories in different departments workshops healthcare center and adequate facilities for sports games and co-curricular activities further the most talked about features of NITC include Education Technology and Library (ETL), Central Computing Center, Center for Career Development (CCD), and a special feature TEDx NITC. Now let's talk about the courses offered at NITC. National Institute of Technology Calicut offers various bachelor's, master's, and doctoral program in engineering, science, technology, and management. There are total ten programs that comes under Bachelor of Technology. So the programs include. Biotechnology, Chemical Engineering, Civil Engineering, Computer Science and Engineering, Electrical and Electronics Engineering, Electronics and Communication Engineering, Engineering Physics. Materials Science and Engineering, Mechanical Engineering, and Production Engineering. Further, the other important courses that are offered here are Bachelor of Architecture for the students interested in architect and designs. Now it's time for eligibility criteria and admission process. The basic eligibility criteria at all the NITs is same. So the candidate seeking admission for the BTEC program at NITC required to qualify for the joint entrance exam (JEE) main and need to pass class 12th board exam with science stream. For general category students, the percentage requirement is 75 percent and 65 percent in case the student belongs to SC, ST, or physically handicapped category. Further, the candidate must register for JOSA counselling based on their JEE main score. Later, candidate will have to verify their documents and pay the required fees. Foreign students are accepted through direct admission of students abroad, DASA, and ICCR schemes. Fee structure: tuition fee for general and OBC candidates having family income greater than five lakh is one lakh twenty-five thousand per annum. For candidates having family income between one lakh and five lakh is forty-one thousand six hundred and sixty-seven per annum. Whereas for students having family income less than one lakh, there is no tuition fee. However, an additional amount of eleven thousand nine hundred and fifty-five is mandatory for all categories. Now, this amount includes expenses like examination fee, admission fee, development charges, and other miscellaneous charges that students need to incur at the time of admission. 
Further, NITC offers certain scholarships and awards to its meritorious students. To get detailed information about scholarships and awards and to check whether you are eligible to get one or not, do visit the National Scholarship Portal on the NITC website. The link is given in the description. Now let's talk about placements at NIT Calicut. NIT Calicut has a good reputation with regards to its placement percentage. During 2022-23 placement drive, total 197 companies participated. The placement percentage of the year was 84.7 percent with 751 candidates placed. The highest package stood at 47 LPA with average package at 14.36 LPA and the median package stood at 10 lakh per annum. Now let's have a look at the regular recruiters at NIT Calicut. The recruiters include Samsung, Google, Suzuki, TVS, HDFC Bank, Ford, Intel, IBM, Reliance, Bharat Petroleum, Discovery Channel, Paytm, Uber, and many more such big brands are the regular recruiters who visit the campus for placements. It's time to look at the NIT Calicut Cutoff 2023. Remember students, seats at all the NITs are reserved. 50% of the seats are reserved for home state candidates, whereas the remaining 50% seats are reserved for all India and other state candidates. Here is the branch-wise cutoff for home state as well as other state candidates. These are the opening and closing ranks after the sixth round of JOSA counselling. Rank cutoff for computer science and engineering after sixth round of JOSA counselling. The rank started at 2024 and closed at 10,512. Therefore, home state candidates should aim to secure rank less than 10,000 and other state candidates should aim to get rank around 5,000. Electrical and Electronics Engineering If you are a home state candidate, that is, if you live in Kerala, then for you the rank requirement is between 18,000 to 20,000 and if you are from other state, then aim to get ranked somewhere between 10,000 to 14,000. In order to get admission in Chemical Engineering branch, target rank for home state candidates should be less than 34,000 and for other state candidates, must target to get rank closer to less than 30,000. Talking about Electronics and Communication Engineering, your target should be to get rank around 14,000 if you are a home state candidate. If you are an other state candidate, then target towards getting 8 to 9,000 rank. Here is the cutoff for all other branches. You can now pause the video or take a screenshot in order to get an idea for your preferred branch. NIT Calicut has a top-notch infrastructure with knowledgeable, experienced and supportive faculty members along with well-equipped laboratories and a vibrant campus life. So if you are planning to go for NIT Calicut, I think it's going to be a good value for money. So this was all from me. I hope you found the video important and relevant. For more such informative content, stay connected. Take care.